to put this in here. Okay, there we go. Now, we just need to put these in order. So, do this one first. This one. This one. That one. Uh, yeah, that one. Then that one. Yay, we did it. Fuck yeah. Okay, we are in. Well, not quite by the looks of it. Okay. Gina wasn't kidding about needing a thermal suit to get past the security. That was pretty much the bad news. God damn it. Shoes. Ah, that's what I was missing. I was missing the shoes. Okay. Hopefully this might work this time. Okay, let's try this again. Now without full costume on. <laughs> I can't believe I was missing one piece. Oh, there's the uh, turret. Oh, and there's Nancy right up there. Okay. Okay, let's quickly go around. Okay, quickly go around there. Oh no, he spotted me. <laughs> I thought I was safe there. Okay, we need to get um, either one of these places, I think. Okay, he's coming around this way. Ooh, that could have ended badly. Okay, quickly get up this way. Okay, which way are you going? Okay, you're going that way. Okay, there's only one way down. Ah, damn it! <laughs> I got detected by him. Yeah, this is gonna be a pain he has to get through. Okay, just wait for him, and we just need to get down over to here. There we go. Uh, I have no idea where I'm going, so just gotta hope that I'm going the right way. Now, this guy is moving a lot slower. Let's move over to there. Okay, going down that way. Okay, let's head on down. I feel like I don't want to touch those. That's when we want to uh, become or have this place become a biohazard. Okay, where about are we going? Okay, we're going over that way. Yeah, great. Oh shit, he's coming through this way. God, I got. Okay, he's just doing the corner. Yeah, that. Oh, okay, um, what are we doing here? Okay, so we do this one first. Okay, that one. There we go, got it. Don't know what that did. Okay, that guy's coming over this way. Which is not good. Okay, we got over this way. Okay, um... I think this just came back around. Yeah, it did. I think. That nearly ended badly. Same with that. Okay, I'm gonna go over this way. Oops, shit. <laughs> I just realized it was coming back up. Didn't get knocked out to move out of the way. Okay, that takes us over here. Ah, okay, so that. Brings us back to the same place, but I do see another thing down there. Okay, 
Hey, there we go. So we got that one. Okay, I don't know how many more of these there are around here. Okay, this brings us around to here. Is this a bunch of TNT? I really hope not. Or dynamite. Because that is very dangerous. Especially with this turrets around. Okay, I want to go around this way. Okay, so he's going around that way. Okay, I want to see what's this way. Oh, okay, so there's the diamonds. So we've got two more of those to find. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, this is going to be tricky to get through. Oh, <laughs> come on, he got me just on the corner. Ha, got another one up here. We just need to wait for that little guy to move it. Come on, go up. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's do this. Oh shit, he's coming back. Ah, damn it. I should have waited for that guy to go. quickly leg it okay made it three here okay let's do it with this one oh, could have almost had that one there we go got it okay one more to find That's our other one. Found it. Okay, now to just uh, get. Oh, no, no, don't go that way. Now we just need to get across to it. Okay, hopefully, he just. Ah, oh, he spots us there. God damn it. Oh shit, he's coming across this way. Oh, god damn it. Thought we were almost out of the clear there. Didn't realise he went all the way over that way. Oh, come on, he spotted me all the way over there. Okay, we might actually be able to get it if we wait for him. I'm quickly go. Oh, come on, I was right there. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, God damn it, I wasn't giving an eye on that one. Okay, finally, we made it. Okay, now to do this. Finally, got all of them down. Okay, now to actually get to the diamond. Uh oh. Oh, caught stuck for there for a moment. I thought I may that may have been a game over for me, but thankfully it was not. Here we are. Now to get across to there. Ah, oh, he 
spotted me. God damn it. <laughs> Both of them spotted me. God damn it. Oh, I was gonna say that was like, kind of a bit close. <laughs> but yeah, I got spotted anyway. Oh, shit. Didn't mean to go down that way. Oops. Oh, ah, so close. I... <laughs> Uh, so close. Ah, damn it. Again, <laughs> got me just on the corner there. Okay, here we go. We might actually better get it if we actually walk that way. Here we go. We good? Really? We gotta get all the way back out again. Uh, God, this is not going to be fun. Okay, this is probably a mistake doing that. Oh, we were very close. Okay, but by the looks of it, we only had to go route one room up. And we're out. Oh, man, that was a pain in the ass to fucking do. But we're done. Okay, we're here. And we got your sapphire. Oh, right. I need to change my costume. Okay, I think that was everything. Okay. Yeah, uh, that was a pain in the ass. But also, let's clean ourselves up after <laughs> that sweaty business. Yep, good for you, Nancy. Okay, now we should be able to get back in. Hello again. You have the sapphire? Nope. You do. What can I say? Work, Samantha, quick. I will. Uh, uh, Excuse me. A bad feeling Pronto. about this. You know the rules, Nico. I cannot tell you what your next target is. You keep a list in that Chinese puzzle box, no? When you shake it, that compartment opens up. Nico, no. How could you have lost it? Never mind. Go to the Capitano and get him to tell you. And when you go after the target, do not wear that costume. You are trying Il Dottori's patience. Okay, ciao. Oh, so here's Il Dottori. Where were we? Ah, your fee. Unfortunately, that is business, which means we cannot discuss it until you have once again beaten me in a game of Scopa. Uh, God damn it. But we also know where the Chinese box is, so we need to quickly get to that before this other guy does. But we need to do this first. We've played all our cards. I took the last trick, so I get all the cards left on the table. God damn it. Okay, let's see no what... points for me. Ah, god damn it. I get one point for having the most tricks. I get one point for having the most coin cards. I get one point for having the seven of coins. Now, let's add up what each card is worth and see who got the highest number of primes. I have the most valuable tricks, so I get one point. And lastly, we score the scopas. God, this is a really bad start. <laughs> oh, and you get to take that straight away. Great. <laughs> Scopa. 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 Oh god, I'm definitely losing this one. He's got like two or three scopers in a row. Scopa. Oh god, he got another one. Jesus Christ. God, this game is going to be over very quickly. God, another one! Jesus Christ, dude, calm down. <laughs> uh, 
I took the last trick, so <laughs> I get all the cards remaining. God, he got most of the freaking cards. God, no that's so annoying. God, look at how many cards I got. <laughs> Compared to his deck. I get one point for having the most tricks. I get one point for having the most coin cards. I get one point for having the seven of coins. Now, let's add up what each card is worth and see who got the highest <laughs> number of prizes. You definitely. I have the most valuable tricks, so I get one point. And lastly, we score the scopas. I'm afraid hey, look. the loser is you. How about another game? God, that was like 1 to 13, Jesus Christ. God, they like upped the um, difficulty level on that one. God. His AI is like on crack or something. But yes, right. we need to do this again. Yes, I got the 7. Okay, that gives me some sort of leverage. Scopa. Scopa. Oh, God, you got two scopas in a row. God. I swear, there's something wrong with this AI, <laughs> especially this round. We've played all our cards. Oh, so you got a freaking so coin, of course you did. All the cards left on the table. Okay, let's see you how we did. One point for having the seven of coins. Yay! But yeah, he's gonna get I like get one point four or five points points here. I get one point for having the most coin cards. Now, let's add up what each card is worth and see who got the highest Ooh, number like of cards. I got it. You have the most valuable tricks, so you get one point. Yay! And lastly, we score the scopas. Yeah, so you got four points there. But we're doing not great now. Ah, oh, damn it, he got a seven. Yeah, got that. I it. took the last trick, so I get all the cards remaining on the yeah, day. Of course she did. You get one point for having the most tricks. Ooh, yay. But you got the most coins I and the seven. One point for having the most coin cards. I get one point for having the seven of coins. Now, let's add up what each card is worth. Okay, he got, see the who got the highest number of points. Yeah, because he got all the seven. I have the most valuable tricks, so I get one point. And lastly, we score the scopas. Uh, he's definitely winning this one again. I took the last trick, so I get all the cards remaining on the table. No points for me. Yeah, I am definitely losing this one again. I get one point for having the most tricks. I get one point for having the most coin cards. I get one point for having the seven of coins. Now, let's add up what each card is worth and see who got the highest number of primes. I have the most valuable tricks, so I get one point. And lastly, we score the scopas. I have the most points, so I win. Do you want to keep playing? <sighs> well, we have to to get paid, so... Sounds good. I mean, we probably don't have to, but... Ooh, I got a 7 first, but... Ooh, I can actually do it too. Hell yeah. Scopa! Scopa! Oh, come on, two in a row, really? Scopa! Oh, wait, really, three in a row? God damn it, I swear the AI is cheating some out. We've played all our cards. I took the last trick, so I get all the cards left on the table. Yep, you do, I know. You get one point for having the seven of coins. Yay, I got one point. <laughs> God I damn get it. One point for having the most tricks. Now, let's add up what each card is worth and see who got the highest number of prizes. Uh, looks like you did. I the most yep. valuable tricks. So I get one point. And lastly, we score the scopas. Yeah, which you fucking cheated on. I took the last trick, so I get all the cards remaining <sighs> on the table. No points for me. I 
<laughs> God, this is like the most so annoying. I get one point for having the most coin cards. I get one point for having the seven of coins. Now let's add up what each card is worth <laughs> and see who got yeah, the highest. See how unfair this shit is. <laughs> I have the most valuable tricks, so I get one point. Yeah, there's no way I'm coming back from this. You took the last trick, so you get all the cards left on. The Yay! Okay, I had a bit of a better round that time. You get one point for having the most tricks. You get one point for having the seven of coins. Okay, I didn't get the most coins no though. Points for you. Now, oh, but we were equal on that. Each card is worth and see who got the highest number of primes. Okay, it looks like he did. The most yep. tricks, so I get one point. And neither of us got scoopers, so. <laughs> Uh, so here we go again. Ah, what a great way to end the last round. Unfortunately, in this case, no point is given for a scopa. Ah, damn, but man, that's you a get first. One point for having the most tricks. You get one point for having Ooh, the yay. most coin cards. You get one point for having the seven of coins. And he got no, no points. points. For you. But he still now, got a point for a scooper. What each card is worth and see who got Ooh, the highest number I of might have won that one. You have the most valuable tricks. Yay. So you get one point. And lastly, we score the scopas. I have the most points, so I win. God, that Would one was like actually kind of close. But yeah, I think we're going to there because he's too much of a cracker yeah. to try and beat. Then our conversation is over. Bye-bye. Nice seeing ya. Oh, uh, he's gone. Colin? Huh. He's packed up all his shit too. Huh. It's definitely strange. But the Chinese box is still here, so... Hey, shake it. Ah, there we go. Now what do we do? Oh, here we go. I forgot that we still had this. Okay, so hold on. We need to go back. So I was looking back through here to see if there was anything that we need to buy, but I forgot that we had that. Yeah, okay. So I'm going to have to write these down so I can then do them in order, I guess. Oh, actually... Okay, I had a better idea. I thought it might be better if I take a photo of it, because I do not know how to do the Chinese things, so... Wait, hold on. I was not there. Okay, dear... My dear Nancy, recent unfortunate events have compelled me to leave Venice rather abruptly. Fear these events, coupled with my hasty departure, will cause you to think less of me than you perhaps already do. Tried to be honest with you, but did not always succeed. For that, I apologize. Fortunately, the mistakes I made in the past still dictate much of what I do in the present. But here's the truth. Being someone as kind-spirited and inquisitive as you was an unexpected joy. Treasure your memory always. Silly Colin. Okay. P.S. I'm leaving behind my Chinese puzzle box as a gift to you. Whenever you lay eyes or hands on it, please think of me. Yeah. If I didn't know the fact that he's in the 30s, it, I probably would have thought differently, but that's kind of creepy. <laughs> anyway, I do kind of want to get changed because I don't think we really need to be in these anymore. Okay, actually I had to look this one up because I would have had no idea what to do, but 
I didn't actually manage to translate them, just didn't know what order I needed to press them in. So we need to do the four elements. So we got wood, none, fire, and then water. There we go. Ooh, and we got the cards again. Share the daily communication point throughout the city for your next assignment or important message. Il Capitano will leave your playing cards to indicate the location of the next hit. Be sure to keep this key in a safe place. Do not lose it. Okay, so yeah, we got Lee Town, uh, Saint something. Um, then we got, I think, a bunch of places. Okay, so it looks like we're going to be looking around. So, what's going on? Did Colin say anything to you before he left? No. When I came out of my room this morning, he was gone. Odd that he left so abruptly. He did have a crush on you. Did you two have a fight? No. Maybe Margareta fouled him. Either way, no great loss. Okay. I'll come back later, okay? Tschüss. Yeah, she didn't seem too quite fond of him. I could use some sleep. Okay, yeah, apparently we need to go to bed now. Because we're done for the day. Uh-oh. We're gonna get another visit? Oh, we got our pager. Okay, let's go quickly to there first. Don't mind me, just come through. Oh, hi, you're back again. Don't mind me, just looking at the architecture again. No, no one's there. I must have just missed him. Damn, what a shame. Uh, funny, it was quick enough. Oop, hold on, hold on. I saw something. Ooh, we got the card. Okay, number eight. Let's have a look. Okay, number eight. Okay, doesn't mean anything. Hmm, that's definitely strange. I see you have recovered from having that locket ripped from your neck. That is what happens when one leaves a door unlocked after one has been told not to. The police said it's very possible that the thief picked the lock. The police know nothing. What do you need from me? I found this card over there. Do you know anything about it? No, it must be trash. The wind blew up here from the street. I was thinking maybe the phantom dropped it. It was the wind, but think what you like. Hmm. A convenient excuse. I saw you coming out of the Argon building. Do you have an office there? No, but I know someone who does. I wanted him to set up a wireless network here in the car. My friends, they all say it is something I must have. You saw me? That is strange. I did not see you. I was uh, in a shop across the street. I saw you through the window. So when will he set up the system? Never. He said he does not do that kind of work anymore. Which made me very angry because I found this flyer here in the car just last week. Look at it. Why would he print that and give it to people if he had no intention of doing what it says? It even came with a discount coupon. Ah, I do not like it when people waste my time. Hmm, seems a bit convenient that she found that, but maybe someone else wanted her to find it. Where did you find this? Where it belongs, in the waste basket. I was not emptying it, I just saw it from across the room. So <laughs> it's all right if I keep this? Sends altro. <laughs> okay. That is all you wanted to ask me? How many people knew you owned the Etruscan figurine that the Phantom stole? Everyone who came to my parties. Hundreds of people. They liked that figurine very much. It is a great loss. But the insurance company is going to pay me more than I thought it was worth. 
We'll just have to buy something else. My guests will like. It looks like Colin just suddenly up and left. I know. I just found out that instead of using the cheapest material he could find to do my renovations like he said he would, he used the best. I just got the bills. It is going to cost me a fortune. He left so he would not have to face me, the coward. I did not want him to use cheap materials, of course. Jiman Karevi Altro. I am just angry that he lied to me. Of course. <laughs> sure. Okay, well, see you later. I'll talk to you later. Ciao. And Nancy, that blouse you are wearing, you should change it. Oh, fuck you. Oh, okay, so they do actually, um, refresh each day. Okay, so I can actually get some new coins. Okay, I didn't have an actual idea, because, uh, looking at this, it almost looks like a phone number. So, one. One, one, hashtag, o four six. No. Or do we need to actually call the number? Okay, hold on. Okay, so, yeah, get rid of unsightly cables and bring your business to the 21st century with digital connectivity. Stay the art wireless phone and computer network will result in happier, happier customers and more productive employees. Now the Ray de Denari is missing. According <laughs> to the list I found in that puzzle box, the Ray de Denari is code for the Palazzo Orpello. I'll bet that's the next place they're going to hit the Palazzo Orpello. Aha, uh -huh. okay, so we need to go there. Okay, awesome. Ah, there we go. I knew I had to use it on something. Ooh, okay. Oh, these are from the music box, isn't it? Okay, so apparently I did that. <laughs> Maybe look this one up, because this one would have taken me way too long, but the uh, music notes and the um, thing here match up. Because do it in order of the um, these things. Because like so, the top row is like one, two, three, yada yada, and then if we do it in yeah order of how the music box played it matches up to this. So yeah, so apparently it goes two nine one hashtag asterisk. Nine nine one asterisk seven o one two one one zero zero two six nine 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 asterisk hashtag nine one. <laughs> Welcome to the automated directory for Sony Trico. For personnel, press one. For store locations, press 2. For communications, press 3. At any time, you may press 0 to return to the previous menu. <sighs> okay, so yeah. And the fact that we couldn't look at this again can, is kind of annoying. <laughs> okay, but anyway, let's uh, go through all these. For Signore Dottore President, press 1. For Signore Capitano Communications, press 2. For Signore Arecino Shipping and Receiving, press 3. For Signore Scaramuccia Security, press 4. 
for Signore Brighella acquisitions, press 5. Huh, interesting. Signore Capitano is responsible for receiving and distributing all incoming and outgoing communications. Sure is. I do not understand that entry. For Signore Dottori, President, press 1. For Signore Capit... Signore Dottori is the President of Sony Trico and is currently not receiving any messages. Okay. I do not understand that entry. For Signore Dottori, President, Signore Alecchino keeps our goods and services safe and secure. I do not understand that entry. For Signore Di Signore Scaramuccia is responsible for providing information on security systems. I do not understand that entry. For Signore Di Signore Bergella acquires goods for resale. It's fine. For all other locations, press six. Well, we can think of it as propane. It's freaking king of the hill. <laughs> Our headquarters are located in the Argon office building in the Capo di Frari. Ah, which is the place that we are currently. I do not understand that entry. For our headquarters, press 1. Our safe and secure store is located near the fountain in the Campo Santa Maria Formosa. I bet that's a safe room where they're keeping the stolen goods. Ah, interesting. I do not understand that entry. For our headquarters, press 1. Our acquisition partners are the Aces, the Knights, and the Kings. For further information, please consult our detailed list available from our Director of Communications or Acquisitions. Okay, thank you, but yeah, I don't think they're going to want to talk to us. I do not understand that entry. For our headquarters, press our sumptuous presidential suites are located in the historic Canas Costa. Huh, okay. Kinda concerning. I do not understand that entry. For our headquarters, our propane storage facilities can be found in the Campo Santa Margarita. Okay, cool, I guess. I do not understand that entry. For our headquarters, we have many temporary meeting spaces available. Please consult your complimentary company calendar for locations available by day. Okay, cool. Okay, we just need to back out and go back in, and then we can do communications. For presidential communications, press 1. For acquisitions, press 2. For security communications, press 3. For shipping and receiving communications, press 4. All presidential communications should be delivered with a box of chocolates to delight the Dottori. <laughs> okay. I do not understand that entry. For presidential community acquisitions meet daily at the temporary meeting spaces. A card indicating our acquisition partner for that day will be delivered there. Yeah, which is probably where we'll be going next. Because we sort of know where they're going, hopefully. I do not understand that entry. For presidential all security communications are initiated with a lovely game of chess. Scaramuccia will determine the location of any follow-up communications. Uh, okay, which we actually figured out earlier, uh, yesterday. I do not understand that entry. For present, acquisitions will deliver all goods to our propane storage facility. Our director of shipping and receiving will then distribute to our safe and secure store for eventual distribution to our home office. Long story short, I think I know where the Phantom is going to strike next. Where? Tell me. I'm pretty sure he's going to steal something from the Palazzo Orpello. You are pretty sure? I'm really sure, as in almost positive. And I know his name is Nico. That's what Tatsa called him anyway. Nico Petit. He's a thief we are very familiar with. He's not very smart, which is why we did not think he could be the Phantom. But if he is taking orders from someone, that is different. Here is the plan. I will call the GDIF and have them send us some agents to stake out the Palazzo Orpello. You must be there too. I must? I mean, okay, sure. But first, you need to do two things. You must give everyone at the Carnas Costa the objects which will allow us to track them. Already did that. Although I think Colin may have left town with his. We will worry about Colin later. Second, you must brush off on your Italian. 
so that during the stakeout you can understand what the agents are saying over the radios. I'll take another look at the guide to basic Italian that's in my room. Good. When you feel you are ready, call me and we will move forward. You got it. Ciao. Okay, good. Okay, at least he didn't show up this time. We can leave that our own accord. Okay, so yeah, we had this here, was it? Yeah, so there was all this, but there was the common phrases right at the back. He had these. Which we kind of went through in the first part, so... Okay, so I took a picture of all of them, so... Um... We call that? Hello, yeah. Nancy. All the tracking devices have been planted, and you have brushed up on your Italian. Si. Good. The stakeout will take place at midnight tonight. You and the GDIF agents will allow Nico to enter the Palazzo Othello, then capture him when he tries to get away with whatever he has stolen. So, I ask you, Nancy, are you sure you are ready to go on the stakeout? Um, as ready as I'll ever be, I guess. I am ready. Then good luck. We will talk again after Nico's happy. Great. Nancy, the four of us agents will be hiding in the courtyard waiting for Nico. We will call over the radio to tell you where we are and pick up from time to time. If you see Nico, let us know where he is and we will try to catch him. But don't give away our hiding places. Okay, we'll do. I see a kitty cat. Oh, hi there. Oh, okay, it's near there. Oh, it's over by the tree, gotcha. Oh, and by the car, okay. Gotcha. I'm very confused. Oh, I had blue. He's behind the statue. Oh, am I supposed to? Very confused <laughs> what I'm supposed to be doing. Is he here? No. I'm very confused. To the right of the red flowers. Oh, he's gone. Okay. He's to the right of the red flowers. That's me. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Dietro la statua. Alla destra dei fiori rossi. He's behind the cat. Oh, did I get it? Oh, he got away. God damn it. Did I get a game over? Yep. <laughs> well, I'm going to get away. It made Nico very happy. Made everyone else with a 50 mile radius extremely unhappy. <laughs> it's very confusing. <laughs> the four of us agents will be hiding in the courtyard waiting for Nico. We will call over the radio to tell you where we are and pick up from time to time. If you see Nico, let us know where he is and we will try to catch him. But don't give away our hiding places. Ah, uh, okay, so it's them telling me where they are. 
Okay, so. Okay, so someone is behind the fountain. Yep. Okay, so yeah, behind the tree. Yeah, and then and behind the thing. Yep. Okay. Yeah, we just need it. He's behind the wall. That's me. Oh, whoops. Okay, I thought he might be there, but. He's behind the fountain. Because you know, nobody's behind the fountain, so. Let's watch this there. Just there. Which is there. Okay, which is behind a tree, so. Oh, he's he's behind there. the cat! He's to the left of the white flowers. Okay, I think I may have gotten it wrong again. Oh, I actually got it right. Fuck yes. Oh, thank fucking Christ. Oh, I was so confused what I was supposed to do there. Oh, God damn it. So we still don't know who Il Dottore is. And we do not know where any of the stolen artwork is. This is not good, Nancy. Now that Nico has been arrested, the theft ring may break up, and we may never recover the stolen goods. Prudence is not going to like that. Was he carrying anything that might help us? A wallet? An address book? I'm looking at the arrest report. Among the items that were taken from him were a silver trumpet that he had just stolen from the Palazzo Opello, a pen, some coins, some matches, a receipt for Papano, I should say propane gas, a used tissue. Wait a minute, propane gas? This receipt, what was on it? I will check the photocopy. It is just an ordinary receipt. It tells the date the gas was delivered, the amount. Hmm, that is strange. What's strange? On the back, someone has written these numbers. 3447. 3447. Does that mean something? Only one way to find out. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Okay, I think I may know where to use the, those numbers. Okay, so something useful actually did come out of it. But yeah, we wasted all that time for all that shit. God, that was annoying. Hey, we got it. Okay, we got some stuff. Okay, so we got uh, more numbers. Yeah. Hey, brain is pretty much sprayed already with these all numbers. We also got a key to somewhere. Okay, well, our business here is done. Okay, I want to try maybe one of these. Seriously, we don't really need it. Okay, we're now here. Cause yeah, um, we're going to the safe place. 
Hello there. Ah, this is the... I was wondering about this, because I would always see it in distance. I was like, why is there a locked door there? Like... Okay, let's do some lock picking. Like, oh no, hell, there, we got the fucking key. I bet this is the safe and secure store that was mentioned on that fax machine. Yeah. Ah, here we go. Oh no, this is the place where we started the game. Uh oh, hold on, this looks familiar. Um, where is it? This? Yeah, here we go. Okay, so yeah, got all this. Ah, uh, yeah, and there's all the things. Gotcha. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Okay, I don't know what that did. Okay, so these change all the things. Yeah, my brain is hurting. I've already done too many puzzles. Oh, okay, that did that, I guess. Okay, let's go across and down. Okay, I'm hoping that was right. Okay, let's continue going down, I guess. Okay, um... We can't really do anything there yet. Okay, we need to go up one floor. Okay, and that's all trapped there as well. Hmm. Oh, hold on, there's stuff on this side. Okay, that should not do that, I guess. Okay, that should have done it. Aha, there we go. Yeah, I just had to drain it out. Because I must have done it the wrong way. So now, I just need to... Oh, this brings it down to here, okay. Okay, and then we want to fill this one up. Okay, fill it up again. No. Ah, here we go. Yeah, and then this gives us another... Okay, so maybe we fill it up. Okay, that didn't do anything. God, this is going to be so fucking confusing. <laughs> One debt to society later. Exit. Don't worry, I'm going to show you this step by step. I've got it all written out, so... Here we are at the circle. We want to cross, but we can't, so we're going to fill it up. Now we can go across, and we want to go down a level, so we're going to drain it. Okay, and now we go down a level. We're at level two, and because circle, we just drained it to level two, we can go cross. And now we're going to drain circle once more. And this is the last time we're ever going to be near circle. No more, no more circle tower for us. We're going straight to the triangle. We go across. And then we drain it. Okay. Then we turn and head for the diamond. As you can see, we can't cross diamond because there's no uh, water, so we fill it. Okay. 
now we want to go down a level, so we're going to drain diamond behind us. Then go down. Okay. And now we're going to drain diamond. Again behind us. So as you can see, circle is at two, triangle is at one, diamond is empty, and we can't get back across diamond. Well, that's not very good, so let's go to triangle. And then don't go across, what we're going to do is drain triangle. Because when you drain triangle, diamond fills. So now we can go back across diamond. And if you check the maps here, see diamond is at 1 and circle is at 2. That's perfect. That is perfect. Because diamond fills up from circle. So now we go up diamond 1 level and we fill her up. Now we do the same thing. We go up a level and fill her up. And now diamonds filled all the way and we have solved the puzzle. That wasn't so bad, was it? Mm -hmm. Okay, finally, we made it across. Okay, thank you to Argul Fump. Probably pronouncing the username wrong, but how did you see this video guy to get across here? Cause there was absolutely no way I was solving that on my own. Because holy shit. Okay, but yeah, I will be linking this video in the description, <laughs> so guys make sure to go check him out and say thank you. <laughs> okay, let's do this, so we can finally- holy shit, it's so dark in here. Uh, I don't like it. <laughs> RIP! Splat! Oops, <laughs> yeah. Maybe we shouldn't have uh, fall, uh, walked into the darkness. <laughs> that is a bad thing. What about this? Oh, a torch. Yeah, that, that is definitely useful. <laughs> okay, let's use that. There we go. Now that is better. Oh, and I think this is where... No? I thought this might have been where the start of the game was, but... Um... Oh, we did have, um, what was the number? And so it was three, five, five, six. Ha, yes. Thankfully, I still had that written down, so. Oh, I'm so smart. Killian, where have I seen that name before? Yeah, that's what I was just thinking. The it was on, on this crate is the same address that was on that letter Helena dropped. Yeah, that's what I was just thinking. Oh god, is it Helena? Helena, don't do this. Mars, great. What the fuck is that? Oh, yeah, here we go. Let me out of here. Hey, open the door. Okay, we need to get the fuck out of here. Oh great, we gotta solve this one. Um, where's my Italian book? There it is. Okay, door will be locked at the water process is not equal. Ah, uh, great. Okay, need to fucking put that away. Oops. Oopsie daisies, didn't mean to do that. Got an air pocket. 
Inke rescued Ventura long after Lena had escaped. Yay! Oops. Okay, so don't make it reach the red. Gotcha. Oh, day. Oh, I got it wrong. God damn it. Oh, it wasn't fast enough. Okay, the green gondola put you out and saved you from drowning. Oh, did I do it? I think I did it. Okay. Oh, finally. Okay, we are good. Let's get the fuck out of here. Nancy, I was starting to be worried about you. It's Helena. Helena Berg. She's Il Dottore. You are sure? Yes, and I think she knows she's been busted. So you have to activate the tracking device I planted on her and find her before she escapes. I will activate her device immediately. But because of Carnivale, there are no officers available to follow her. You will have to do this, Nancy. Uh, of you course we do. need a tracker? After I have activated the tracking device, your PDA will show a picture of what method of transportation she has taken. Whether she's traveling on foot, in a gondola, or by Vaporetto. From time to time, it will also announce where she is. Why can't it announce where she is all the time? The transmission of a continuous signal would make the device too easy to detect. So please, Nancy. Watch your PDA. It will tell you Helena's method of transportation and her last location. Use this information to figure out where she is headed so you can go to that place and intercept her. But you must move quickly or she will get away. I will send someone to help you as soon as possible. Okay. This prudence officer did not like that she forced you on us. But when you are on a case, you are like a dog with a bone. I like that, Nancy. There, Helena's tracking device is activated. She is all yours. Hurry. At least somebody can trust us. Nothing you can. You know Okay, let's do this. Still here. Okay, let's quickly go. Half, don't you? Okay, that was just surprisingly easy. Don't try to hide from me, Helena. Nancy, what are you doing here? Getting my locket back. What are you? A cop? A government agent? A thief? What? What do you want? I'm just an amateur detective who wants what all decent people want: justice. I had a feeling you were up to something. Your sudden arrival at Nascosta. Your feigned interest in Venice always asking questions. You've been watching Fango from the Altena all this time, haven't you? And now the little spy wants her locket back. Well, good. Because you're not getting it back. Ever. Yeah, I wouldn't say that so soon. She's getting away! Gotcha. Don't be too pleased with yourself, Nancy Drew. It's not over between us. Not by a long shot. True to her word, Helena didn't go quietly. After she was arrested, she insisted that because of me, a silly American teenager, a terrible mistake had been made. She claimed that not only was she innocent, but the locket around her neck was hers. But after I showed the authorities everything I discovered, it became clear that all the thefts attributed to the Phantom of Venice were actually perpetrated by a gang, her gang. It started with Hildegard Killian, a wealthy pork belly heiress in Chicago, who gave Helena a list of the Venetian art objects for which she would happily pay a small fortune should Helena somehow obtain them for her. Inspired by what she had learned while covering the trial of criminal mastermind Leo Macchiano, 
Helena subtly pumped her sources in the police department for the names of known or suspected criminals who could serve her purposes, which enabled her to put together her very own theft ring made up of Antonio Fango, codename Il Capitano. Using everything from trained pigeons to chess notations to chocolates, he made sure everyone in the ring knew what they needed to know by the time they needed to know it. Gina Scaramuccia, a civil engineer familiar with practically every security system in existence, she determined the best way to steal an item and, via Il Capitano, passed this information along to Nico Petit, Brigella, who did the actual stealing. It was his idea to wear the mask and cape while pulling the heists, something of which Helena, Il Dottore, did not approve. He delivered what he stole to Enrico Tazza, Arlecchino. He hid the items in paper mache carnival costume heads and stashed them away until they could be shipped to Hildegard Killian. But thanks to Sophia and me, they're all on their way to prison. Prudence Rutherford was so delighted that all the stolen objects were recovered undamaged that she's decided to include me in her memoirs. Damn it. Which I guess I'm supposed to consider a great honor. Margarita is delighted too. <laughs> Everyone thinks that because I was staying at Ca Nascosta, she was somehow instrumental in solving the case. She's suddenly the darling of Venetian high society, which for her is a dream come true. That one of the death faces or something? Like... called me once out of the blue. He had read about the Phantom's capture and had just one question. Did I get my locket back? When I said I had and was wearing it, there was a long silence, then he just hung up. <laughs> For a while I felt bad. No, don't feel bad, then he's I a fucking creep. All those slides. No, no, do not be interested. <laughs> and we finally finished it. Yay! Oh my god. <sighs> I am glad to have been done. Ah uh, yeah, Luigi doesn't sing because he was the free one. Oh yeah, I got it. Correct, I got literally nothing else. Okay, so there was something about a shoe. Oh, the dancing one. And <laughs> the easter egg that we got from unlocking that door. Oh, so we didn't find all the spare change. Well, I didn't realise until much, much later in the game. Um, oh yeah, tried on all the clothes, which yeah, we didn't have enough money. Oh, we could have tried the ice cream. I didn't, I couldn't figure out how to, so I could have, god oh, damn it. Oh, uh, so I could have visited the uh, bathroom more for that one. Oh, and this would have been for um, all the... Uh, car rides, which I didn't want to use because of money. Oh yeah, um, apparently there was um, sausages you could have picked up at some point. Which I somehow missed. And yeah, it was supposed to be a present from Colin. <laughs> and you're supposed to get sick from it, so yeah. Okay, for a perfect mosaic. Okay, don't know how I would have gotten that one. Oh, and then probably use all my Italian dictionary for everything. Okay, well, we are finally done. Castle Malloy has stood empty for almost a century in a remote corner of Ireland. The few who have dared to walk among its crumbling walls have told tales of devious fairies, ghostly lights, and a cursed spirit haunting the ruins. When an old friend of mine insists on holding her wedding there, things quickly go from merry to menacing, and I soon find myself probing the darkest corners of the castle, struggling to unearth its secrets. Secrets which may have already cost the groom his life. Now join me as I make my way through this long forgotten fortress in the haunting of Castle Malloy. Ooh, that seems interesting. Yeah, uh, I'm so glad to have been done with that one. Because this one, well, interesting. It wasn't that great, at least gameplay wise, because holy shit, some of those puzzles. Because <laughs> some of them, yeah, don't know how the hell I would have was supposed to figure some of them out. You see, the last puzzle with the freaking sewer level, I got stuck in that for fucking ages. <laughs> but yeah, this 
Unfortunately, it was probably my least favorite game of the Nancy Drew series. I mean, I like the characters. The story was interesting, but yeah, just the gameplay was, yeah, yeah. Even for somebody like me who's not that smart, some of the puzzles and their solutions were, yeah, uh, yeah. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed my uh, let's play of this, nonetheless. And yeah, hopefully the next Nancy Drew game we play is a bit better than this one. 